Hey, how's it going everybody? It is Mayor Joshi here, and today we're going to be playing a little bit of Animal Crossing New Leaf in this spin-off video journal series where we're going to scan the brand new Welcome Amiibo Amiibo cards for Animal Crossing New Leaf, and we're going to visit four random animals RVs to see what they're up to. Let's do this. Oh man. Well, her name is Biddy, B-I-T-T-Y. There ain't nothing Biddy about this gal. This is a full-figured gal right here. Oh, hello, do you live here? Well, it's a pleasure to visit, my dear. I, if if she eats me, I'm gonna be really, really sad. Look, does she just have one? Oh no, she has two teeth. I was gonna say, does she have one tooth? So she's a hippo, and frankly, I kinda like her, to be totally honest with you. She looks very weird and goofy, and I, I respect that. Now, there's no need to make a fuss over me. You can just treat me like a regular citizen. Oh, she's a little bit full of herself. That's pretty cool, too. What do we got here? You got clothing? Your wardrobe? What is this thing? I don't even know. We'll look at that later. Huh. She's got some, some pretty fancy music. KK Disco, baby! My whole head could fit in her mouth. Oh, my shoulders are killing me. Next time I'm hiring a chauffeur. Oh man, I, I, I'm getting strangely, strangely attracted to this hippo. I can't even believe how well one can live out of a car these days. Isn't it fabulous, my dear? Wow. So her bio says, Biddy is the center of the scene no matter where she goes. And with a van full of designer goods, the campground is basically her runway. Huh. Yeah. What is this thing? Oh, a dressing room, I bet. Yep, I wish I could go in there. All right, Biddy, I'm gonna go get changed, so I'm gonna be naked. No peeking. What does she got in here? Mosaic wall, lobby floor, changing room. There you go. Uh, fancy display case. Ooh, that is fancy. Fancy display stand. Hanger rack. <laughs> that The shirt in the front looks like Santa Claus's uh, shirt or coat, which, based on the size of her, seems about right. Jewelry case. Perfume bottles. A ring. Ooh. And a wood container. Wooden container. That's kind of interesting. That's That'd be good for like a store. But, uh, huh. Biddy, you're pretty interesting. I like you. What do you look like when you're shocked? Oh, God, look at her eyeballs. Oh! All right, let's chat her up just a little bit more before we leave her alone. She's got a lot of stuff on her mind. She's a diva. Please don't question my driving or parking skills. You couldn't begin to understand the level I'm in. On. This is, uh, that's worth taking a picture of. <laughs> all right, Biddy. Goodbye. You're something. You are something, all right, Biddy. And that something is filled with donuts. Oh, okay. This guy's a little bit more gruff. Oh, man, listen to this music he's got going. Hoo-hoo! Not, what is this? KK Rockabilly, man. I feel like I'm at a Chuck E. Cheese, baby. Hey, look at this guy, Stu. Do you live here? What time is it? I, 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 I'm Stu, and I love veggie foo. What the heck? Oh, I like his face there. Ka-ching. Don't mind me just snapping photos of you to look at later when I'm in bed. I'm going to kiss your photos, Stu. What? I mean, never mind. Uh, Stu's pretty cool. Look at him. Oh, wow. What is going on here? What is Stu's personality? Sorry about that. You startled me for a second there. Yeah, I tend to do that to people. So Stu seems really into like cycling or something. Yeah, he's definitely uh, a cyclist. Oh, man. For those of you who have been paying attention to my videos on Animal Crossing, you would know that cyclists are the worst human beings on the planet. Uh, his, um, his bio on the bottom screen says, If it's got two wheels, Stu loves it. Just call him Stu Wheels. What? If you're hoping to use any of his of any of his lockers, he hates that. Okay. So apparently this guy is actually not as wonderful as we assumed he is. What's in his locker? Pretend like nothing was seen. <laughs> I love that. I love some of the translation work where it's just really dark. Like what, what did he have in his locker that we didn't that we weren't supposed to see? Oh, Stu! Huh, did you say something? Hey, Stu, let's talk, baby. Why did you choose this? Why did I choose this campground? Excellent question, Moo Dude. Ooh, he just called me Moo Dude. 
I've been waiting all my life for somebody to call me Moo Dude. Well, I read a magazine article about how great the food was around here and jumped in the car. Uh-oh. I think I left behind some perfectly good... Kvitch on the counter? What the heck is Kvitch? Kvitch? Kvitch, what is this? Kvitch? Oh my lord, he forgot the Kvitch! Kvitch, um, shouldn't that word be censored? You're not supposed to say Kvitch. Let's talk to him a little bit more. I do like his setup here. I, I, I'm not a fan of cycling, because... reasons. I'm hungry for something cheap and grubby, but made with only the finest local ingredients. Well, then it wouldn't be cheap and grubby, my friend. You have no idea what you're talking about. Huh. This guy's confusing me. Well, that was Stu. What kind of furniture can I order? I guess we should look at that. Chain link fence, pavement floor, Boston bag. What? That's kind of cool. Could I ever, could I use that bag for anything? Ooh, I don't know. I kind of like the look of it. Eh. Cardboard box. Locker cruise bike. Cruiser bike. Man. <whistles> That's a sweet huffy. Do not enter sign. That's not a do not enter sign. That's a, what? Do not enter sign? Hold on a second. I'm, I'm taking a picture and alerting the authorities that this is not properly translated. That's a cyclist sign. Garbage bin. That's where I belong. Ch oh, actually, could I use the garbage bin for something? Hmm. I always see these items and I'm like, ooh, I might be able to use that. But then I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to use that for. Ooh, it's a kick scooter. Eee. It's a scooter. Okay. A kick scooter I might be able to use for something too. Oh. All right. Well, Stu, thanks for having us. Bye, you cretin. Oh, my goodness. Check this guy out. Holy crap. Oh, and listen to the mute. What, Boyd, what are you listening to? KK Groove. Oh, dang, son. Wow. Ooh, hoo, hoo. His name is Boyd. Oh, look at him. He's pretty cool. I, I was going to say I don't like his cheeks, but to be honest with you, I do like his cheeks. Humph. This place is nice enough, I guess. Yeah, I'll just stick around for a while. Boyd, you're sticking around for longer than a while. You're sticking a around for a lot of a while. Come on, let us get a look at you, Boyd. Wow, what's his personality like? When, when I breathe in this clean... F wait, wait, what? When, when I breathe in this clean forest air, I think life is good. I'd go camping more often. Wait, he... So that's a translation error, right? They just put when, when. When, when I breathe in this... Boyd is malfunctioning. <laughs> Why? I just saw a translation area in there. Why are we getting all these errors in translation? We just saw the cycling sign was like a no enter sign, which is not true. And then now he doesn't know how to speak. Okay, I'd go camping more often, but all that positive thinking isn't too good for my health. Uh huh. Boyd, I kind of like Boyd a lot. Is it too early to propose to Boyd? Boyd's bio on the bottom screen says, Give a gorilla a forklift and he'll lift all the forks. Boyd may be a bit rough around the edges, but he's a good guy to know when you need to move. That's pretty good. That's it. Boyd, get over here so I can talk to you appropriately. I don't want to talk to you from a side view. I want to be able to really look at you. He keeps, he's a little grumpy, but he's... I'm good with that. I was thinking, I might hang my laundry out on these trees back here. I think we've heard the uh, animal say that before. What can we order? Blue tarp, closed road. That's a really neat sign, bus stop sign. I kind of like that sign. Detour, forklift, garbage bin. Ooh. Manhole cover. Metal can. W what a boring thing, a metal can. Well, plastic can. Ooh, a plastic canister. Wow. What a time to be alive. There's a plastic canister item in Animal Crossing. Ooh! That's a neat thing. I'm gonna get that, but hold on a second. Wet road. Okay, let's get the pylon set. Let's order that. I feel like I could use that for something. It just looks... It looks... I don't know. It looks useful for something. And... Let's, let's talk to this fellow a little bit more. I'm definitely asking this fool to move in. He's good. 
everyone says they want to get back to nature, as long as they don't have to give up all the modern amenities. Amenities. Eh, who cares? If mountain lions had TV, they'd love it too, right? Actually, I think there's probably mountain lions living in my town, so that's kind of offensive, Boyd. I mean... Huh. Well, let's ask him to move in, because I'm not losing this guy. He's got a wonderful musk about him. What a flattering proposition. Now, the problem, of course, is that I'm going to have to ask somebody to move out, right? Wait, what did he say? Oh, I guess I don't have to have... Oh, I guess somebody moved out without me even knowing. What the heck? All right, well, he's moving in. Everybody make room, because Boyd is making his... I forgot to beep the horn to scare him. I'm not a fan of his, like, layout here, though, because... It's very crowded. And he won't come over here. Boyd, you know what? You're kind of... There you go. I want to see what his face looks like when he's scared. Oh. Oh, wow, he does... He's one of the... See, a lot of the characters don't, like, physically move their mouth open, but he talks with his mouth. Most of them talk through a textured mouth. Oh. All right, well, Boyd... Oh, man. Look forward to doing stuff with him. All right, and our final animal of the journal here is Cleo. And in case you can't tell, the theme here has been... I picked a bunch of very large animals to talk to for this one. <laughs> Cleo's pretty large. She's a freaking horse. Oh, hello. Do you live here? Well, it's a pleasure to visit. Sugar? She called me Sugar. You guys, I think this horse is hitting on me. This is awkward. Now, there's no need to make a fuss over me. You can just treat me like a regular... Ooh, she's got kind of a sassy attitude going on. I generally actually am attracted to sassy people. Wow, she's got a really respectable, um, clean house going on here. Well, it's not a house, it's an RV, but... What's up, Cleo? Does anybody remember Miss Cleo? She was a fortune teller and she had really crappy public access TV commercials. She was a fortune teller. Miss Cleo, she's gonna read your fortune. Let's talk to Cleo. Excuse me, can you tell me where to find this campground spa service? Sugar, I'm a joking. I, I turned on Mario there for a little bit. Uh, unless there really is a spa service. Ooh, yeah, she is high maintenance. Yeah, that's the way I like my ladies. High maintenance, a little sassy. I like this. Let's scare her by beeping the horn. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with doing that, but I, I, I feel like I always have to do it. Ooh, there's a phone. She's got some good items in here that I might want to actually... Uh, I want to order. Uh, her bio says, Technically, Cleo doesn't take her work home with her. She takes it camping. With files and taxes at the ready, she can be productive anywhere. I don't know if I would date somebody like Cleo because she seems like she's a little self-centered. She seems like she wouldn't need me. And I need a girlfriend to desperately need me. Otherwise, how do I know that I'm of any kind of value? Oh, it's you. Well, of course it's me. I haven't left. What do you... Cleo seems a little weird, actually. Don't look too closely at anything in her. I haven't been tidying up to my usual standards. She's turning Scottish a little bit as well. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, let's go to the uh, for furniture. Got an office wall. We got a panel carpet floor. Ooh, I kind of like that. Document stack. Hey. File cabinet L. All right. Laptop. Meeting room table? That's kind of cool. It's not really a meeting room table because there's a place for a keyboard underneath that. A meeting room table would be like very large. What the heck? Modern office chair, that's kind of neat. I like that. Office phone. I do like that rolling cart. I think I might get the rolling cart. Rolling file cart. White office desk. I'm gonna get the rolling cart. I like that thing. I have no idea what I'm going to use it for, but I feel like at some point I could use that for designing a uh, room or something. All right. All right, Miss Cleo. It's been truly wonderful. I got a New Year's hat on too, by the way. It's pretty nice. It's pretty nifty. Let's talk to her one last time. Let's, let's talk. Cleo. Excuse me, can you tell me what... You just said that, Cleo. What a disappointing, repetitive horse you truly are, Cleo. Way to end it on repetition. Hey everyone, thanks for watching this Animal Crossing video from the BitBlock. Did you know that you can grab yourself some totally original Animal Crossing inspired apparel from our Tee Public shop just like these two sassy designs right here? Well, you can grab your very own at the link in this video description.